A revealing moment from last night's Republican debate was the audience attitude towards the nation's unemployed. Two weeks ago, you said, don't blame Wall Street, don't blame the big banks. If you don't have a job and you're not rich, blame yourself. That was two weeks ago. The movement has grown. Do you still say that? Yes, I do still say that. And here's why. Wow, a GOP debate crowd taking pleasure in the misfortune of others. Where have we seen that before? Governor Perry, a question about Texas. Um, uh, your state has executed 234 death row inmates, more than any other governor in modern times. Have you... Are you saying the society should just let him die? No. Do you intend to circumvent the progress that's been made for gay and lesbian soldiers in the military? Yeah. I, I... You know, if the audiences are that extreme... What does it say about the candidates they're coming to see? It is a Ponzi scheme. We need to repeal Obamacare. Do not raise the debt ceiling. If you want to put people in jail, I want to second what Michelle said. You ought to start with Barney Frank and Chris Dodd. Well, the crazy talk finally got personal last night. We'll have the fallout from the Romney-Perry showdown next.